hope you didn't bend your valve or anything. Look at that. It's set at 10. 10 degrees. I sent it to a body shop. But um, there's a lot of story on this car. Since I bought this, I bring this car on the shop. First, um, the rims was stolen inside the shop. See this one right there? I think that's the reason why the compression is a little bit lower because it's already sharing from one to another. This one still have a little bit left on there. Uh, something similar, I guess. It could be the uh, head is warped or something. Because I'm going to repair or try to repair that as much as I can because I can't put that cylinder head back in there without doing anything on the relief. As you can see, right there. See, it started to uh, make its own seat right there. And so is this one right there. Good. Perfect, yeah. Thank you. Oh, sh it's kind of scary, huh? <laughs> yeah. It's like, man. What is that? Is that the torque wrench? <laughs> so intense. Uh huh? The last torque. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, nothing. Alright, I'm gonna change this one and I think that should work. <laughs> Man, a simple fuse. I'm gonna start right here. Just simply going to bridge this connector. Yeah! Oh man! And the fan works! Oh man, right on! The B20 VTAC is nearly done. I just noticed something that I have some oil seeping through within this area. I got some napkins on there to eliminate the, uh, the cam cover and the uh, VTEC switch, VTEC solenoid uh, seal gasket. But so far, it looks good. The DC also. Oh, there it is, I think. Yeah, it looks like uh, it's coming from uh, the VTEC seal. I'm gonna put a fresh napkin on there and then I'll check it again. Man, but uh, this area is a little bit, uh, I guess it's power sweat. <laughs> Sounds good though. I guess I have to say goodbye to this bad boy. I'm gonna take it out for a drive. I wanna see how the steering will look. If it need a an advanced tutorial for Jer. I sure did spend a lot of time, some research, some effort on trying to get this thing somewhat in a good running condition as is right now. You know, you probably would not believe it, but he actually wanted to have this thing uh, <laughs> boosted. Yeah, I didn't go for it. I said, no, it's too good to, uh, to blow up. Right there. He's already set up for it. He's got the intercooler and everything. But I just didn't go for it. There's a lot of things that need to be done on the uh, on the block. Oh, and also I just got done putting the uh, or securing the battery right there. It's not the ideal one to use. It's supposed to use a uh, a dry cell on this. I told him to get a dry cell. This will be good as a temporary uh, fix for now. It's not good 
this has to be vented outside because it's poisonous. And what else? Oh, back in the 90s, man, cotton coils. <laughs> yeah. So there you have it. I just want to check the steering wheel. Make sure that the alignment is uh, turned out to be okay. to the left a little bit the GoPro died other than that everything is good it rides good scraping a little bit and also it pulls to the left just a little bit but it's hardly noticeable other than that it's all good It's done. Okay. And let's check for the uh, oil seeping through on the cylinder head gasket. Well, I don't see it. Hmm. That's weird. I wonder where did the oil came from. It's not coming from the VTEC solenoid, from the seal and also the distributor. But man, it should have been leaking already. Oh well. I guess uh, I'll tell them to monitor it. Well, Jerry's here to pick up the car. So I finally have to say goodbye to this uh, uh, V20 uh, EJ1 Civic. All right. So, uh, well, I will let you have your car. And it's been an honor uh, for me working on this one. Yeah, I'm gonna miss this car. It looks pretty good. I mean, I got the right stance and everything. Yeah. It's just perfect. Uh, I wish I had one. I wish I can turn my uh, the daily, uh, daily like oh, this, yeah. but. Uh, you never know. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Maybe ne tomorrow you will. Tomorrow it's gonna be It's nothing impossible to sagit. Yeah. <laughs> this is uh, uh, Jer's brother Raymond. <laughs> All right. So. Thanks for. You have uh, extra engine there. Ah. <laughs> I tr actually have two uh, spares that I could I can put on. Uh, but anyway, so uh, yeah, I'm going to say goodbye to this uh, bad boy, and I sure did a lot of things or work on things that uh, I can't believe that people could uh, do such a thing. Yeah. All right. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys back. Bye, everyone. Yeah, thank you, thank you, yeah. And that's a vibrant resonator. Resonator, right? Vibrant resonator. Yeah. Cool. Good.